Hi students, if you like this video, please subscribe and share it. Don't forget to like it. Now I am going on, topic is heights and distances. Now our question is, let a vertical tower AB have its end A on the level ground. Let C be the midpoint of AB and P be a point on the ground such that AP is equal to 2AB. And also if angle BPC is equal to beta, then tan beta is equal to. Say now here AB be a vertical tower, A on the ground level. Now C be the midpoint. Now, P be the point on the ground. Here, P be the point on the ground. Now, angle BPC. Angle BPC. BPC is equal to this one beta. Let here angle APC is equal to alpha. Now we total alpha plus beta. Okay, now here height of the tower pitch. Height of the tower pitch. Now midpoint means now we are h by 2 and here also h by 2. Okay, h by 2 and h by 2. Okay, now First year from triangle AB is equal to 2AB. Now here AB is equal to given AB is equal to 2AB. Now AB value H. Now AB is equal to 2H. This value is 2H. Okay. Now here first from triangle APC. APC. Triangle. APC tan alpha is equal to tan alpha is equal to h by 2 by 2 h h by 2 by 2 h h by 4 h h h cancel is equal to 1 by 4 okay tan alpha is equal to 1 by 4 okay now from triangle APB triangle a P B. Now tan alpha plus beta is equal to tan alpha plus beta is equal to now h by 2 h h by 2 h h h cancel now tan alpha plus beta is equal to 1 by 2. Now find tan beta. Now tan beta is equal to now tan beta is equal to tan alpha plus beta minus alpha alpha plus beta minus alpha now tan beta can be right now here tan alpha plus beta minus alpha tan a minus b now tan alpha plus beta minus tan alpha by 1 plus tan alpha plus beta into tan alpha. Okay, now tan alpha plus beta value is 1 by 2. 1 by 2 minus 1 by 4 by 1 plus 1 by 2 into 1 by 4. Now here 1 by 4 by 1 plus 1 by 8, 9 by 8. 1 plus 1 by 4 by 9 by 8. Okay, 1 by 4 into 8 by 9. Now 2 by 9. Okay. Tan beta is equal to 2 by 9. Okay. Now option 3 is the correct one. Next one is a pole is slightly inclined towards the east at two points due west of it at distances a and b. The angle of elevation of the top of the pole are alpha and beta respectively. The inclination of the pole to the horizontal is. Okay, now we are east. This one west. Okay, 
slightly towards east a pole a now at two points due to west at distances a and b a the angle of elevation is alpha now at distance b now the angle of elevation beta okay now the inclination of the pole to the horizontal pole to the horizontal now inclination this one now draw draw the perpendicular this one to horizontal now this one theta this one is theta here height of this one h here distance x a now a b c and d this one e okay now here three triangles is there now from triangle ecd triangle ecd tan theta is equal to h by x now equation 1 from triangle ebd from triangle ebd triangle ebd cot alpha is equal to x plus a by h x plus a by h now x plus a is equal to h cot alpha now equation 2 okay from triangle ead triangle ead now cot beta is equal to cot beta is equal to b plus x by h or x plus b by h x plus b by h okay now by cross multiplication by cross multiplication x plus b is equal to x plus b is equal to h cot beta h cot beta now equation 3 now here multiply with b in equation 2 multiply with a in equation 3 now 2 into b minus 3 into a implies okay now 2 into b means now bx plus ab bx plus ab minus ax minus ab is equal to bh cot alpha bh cot alpha minus ah cot beta okay now here ab ab cancel now x common b minus a is equal to now here h common b cot alpha minus a cot beta okay now x by h x by h x by h is equal to b minus a by b cot alpha minus a cot beta now x by h means x by h is equal to sorry x h by x is equal to b minus a by h by x is equal to b minus a by b cot alpha minus a cot beta now from equation 1 h by x is equal to tan theta okay now here from equation 1 h by x is equal to tan theta now tan theta is equal to b minus a by b cot alpha minus a cot beta 
Now theta is equal to tan inverse of b minus a by b cot alpha minus a cot beta. Now option 2 is the correct one. Next one is a tower ABCD stands on a level ground with foot A at a point P on the ground. The position AB, AC and AD subtends angle alpha, beta, gamma respectively. If AB is equal to A, AC is equal to B and AD is equal to C and AP is equal to X. And also alpha plus beta plus gamma is equal to 180 degrees. Then A plus B plus C into X square is equal to. Okay, now A, B, C, D is a tower. Now, this one A, B, C, D. Now A, B, C, D. Now, at a point P on the ground position. At the point P on the ground position. Now A B A C A D. Now A B A C A D. Now we are now a B is alpha. Now we are alpha. This one beta. Now we are this one gamma. Okay. Now A B is equal to A. Here A. Next to A C B. And also A B. A D C. A D is C. Okay, now AP is equal to X are given. Okay, first from triangle APB triangle APB tan alpha is equal to A by X tan alpha is equal to A by X. Okay, from triangle now APC tan beta is equal to B by X. Okay, from triangle APD triangle APD. Now tan gamma is equal to C by X. C by X. Okay, now Another condition is alpha plus beta plus gamma is equal to 180 degrees. If alpha plus beta plus gamma is equal to 180 degrees, then sigma tan alpha is equal to sigma tan alpha is equal to pi tan alpha. Sigma tan alpha is equal to pi tan alpha. Okay, sigma tan alpha means tan alpha plus tan beta plus tan gamma is equal to tan alpha into tan beta into tan gamma. Okay, now a by x plus b by x plus c by x is equal to a b c by x a cube. And it also x a plus b plus c. Now a b c by x a cube. X and no, cancel now. A plus b plus c into x square is equal to a b c. Therefore, option one is the correct one.